Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh Gorantla and today we are going to discussing about mobile automation testing by using Python. Hi friends, welcome back. And today we are going to discussing about Java setup. Okay, this is a main for that. Okay, I'm going to maximizing this now. Okay. Here one by one, step by step, I'll show you. The similar format you need to download and do it, okay? And for this, I'm going to do for Java 11, okay? First, you need to search for Java 11 download for Windows, okay? Then you will get it for the first link, Java SC double one, Arch double downloaders. <clears throat> this is a link you will get it in the first, okay? Click that particular link. Once you click, it will navigate into Oracle website, okay? And just drag a little bit down, and there you can able to see for Java SC downloader 11, it will be 11. There are some set of like uh, versions will be there. Choose any version, it will work perfectly. There is no issue. If you choose nine, if you choose for eight, anything is okay, okay? And there is a last to second one, it will be there. You need to click that particular downloader. Here it will be downloader will be there. You need to click that particular downloader, okay? Once you click that particular one, it will navigate into this particular page, okay? Here this is the page you can able to see, right? Checkbox and download, downloader link. Once you check, then only it will enable. Until that, it will not be enabled. It will be disabled. Yeah, how many times you will click? It will not start for downloading, okay? First check the checkbox, then click for that. Once you click, it will navigate into Oracle page. Okay, here what you have to do, you have if you have already Oracle account, then use for username and password and login, then automatically it will download. Okay, in case if you don't have, then you can start for creating Oracle account. Okay, you can use for Gmail or something, you can able to download it. Okay. No need for company webs, uh, company URL and all, company email ID is not required. Just your Gmail account also is enough. Click and create and provide for username, password and which password you want to choose, a confirm password and all. Then it will create for account. Then automatically it will download for exe into your downloader location. Once you see that, that, that particular downloader, right? Then click for double click on that particular exe. Okay, once you click the exe, it will show you this particular page. Okay, setup wizard will be started. Okay, once it is started, you need to click for next button. And again, if you want to path change, you can choose for uh, location, any other location. If you want uh, D drive or E drive or somewhere you want to store that particular Java to store, you can click on change and provide the path then automatically it will store that particular location. Once you change the path, then you can click on next. If you don't want, go for directly next button, okay? Once you click the next button, it will start for uh, wizard uh, installation, okay? Once it is done, then it will give you for this particular success message, okay? Close that particular window and open for CMD and try to get it for Java space iPhone iPhone version. Then it will give you for which version you downloaded and save it. Okay. In my case, it is Java 11.0.18 is there. And in your case, based upon you are convenient. If you are downloading for 12, Java 12 or Java 11, Java 13 or Java 17, which version based upon that version, it will be displayed. Okay. And here after this, you have to do some set of environment variables setup. Okay and click for edit environment variables. This is the main uh, for environments, okay? And click on environment. Here you need to create for Java home one, click on new, and here you can provide for Java underscore home and path of your Java. Where you can able to find the Java path, go to C drive, programs and Java and JDK. This path you have to copy. This is the home. Okay. Once you've done the home and you can uh, paste it here and copy that home variable name which you have provided. Okay. 
and open for path this is a path edit and you need to pass for percentage java home percentage slash bin that is the one you, you can able to save okay once you put that bin then close like click okay 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 once you click installation and environment variable setup both are completed okay if you try this particular uh, java space hyphen hyphen version it will provide you properly okay in case if you face something but 100 percent without setup you can't able to use for java but you have, must install for java uh, like uh, version uh, setup you need to do for environment variables okay and next video session we'll uh, discuss about new topic okay thank you for watching